the harder levels for uh, players to learn, but I think ultimately um, they're very straightforward, especially when you've run this game for the past, I don't know, eight years, Truman, right? <laughs> yeah, it's been about eight years, actually, I think this month, so... Uh... It's been we actually quite a started while, at the uh, same time. You and me started at the same time. We uh, we started racing on SRL back in the day. That's the only reason I know it's been about eight years is because it's been about that long for me. Oh, yeah, for sure. No, uh, and I mean, eight years ago, we were racing on SRL, but, you know, the weekly's still going strong. We got a great community, even if it's not racing on SRL anymore, racing on race time. But definitely, definitely a lot still going on for SMW right now. Oh, yeah. Every week, Fridays, 8 p.m., we're actually starting to uh, restream the weekly races now, so if you ever want to catch some of the top runners doing That's their 96 awesome. weeklies, you can check it out on the Super Mario World Twitch channel. Really good at uh, getting through World 1 without realizing you've actually played World 1. <laughs> <laughs> and you, you hear that whistle after beating Eggy here, and you're like, okay, finally the run can start. Yeah, finally, finally we get to the good part, which is uh, Cape. Finally, we can just fly over all the levels, except that's not really true. And it's like, I could make a comment about how uh, the cycles line up in this, or how the dry bones despawn, but then I'm going to be running into the next levels that I want to talk about. <laughs> I know, I I fought the urge to mention why did he spin his cape right at the beginning of this level. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> RNG minute. That's the short answer. It makes yeah, Bowser happy. They... Or that. Yeah, it's for the fans, and Bowser is the fans, I guess. Level's over. All right, let's <laughs> let's get reading. All right, we now we 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 completed special world. And now we get back to a boring normal world, but it's gonna look a little different. Except now he's a super player. Yeah, that's that's true. I think, I mean, I, we're really all super players when it comes down to it. It's time for pumpkin spice normal world. Let's go. Ghost house clip. I, you know, I really don't think I am. This man's not even going to take a shot at the quad club. <laughs> the author, author blues quad. Yes! <laughs> Redemption. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yay, a yump. What, what a fortuitous set of circumstances. Okay. And again, another smooth yeah. stage from Paul. Just, yeah, the, the game is very fast, and we have our first boss. These rocks that you see coming down from the ceiling, uh, some people may think they're RNG, but they're, in fact, based on your position, they'll come down. And Paul Missed is, the second hit. Oh, but we're still doing good. We're still in there. Nice, nice, very nice. Ah. Good backup, good backup. And very nice first room, taking that, that boost to uh, basically trigger the end stage uh, transition there. Oh. Oh, oh, messed up oh, there. You Those, jerk. Yeah, that is a definite jerk from the, that roller guy. There's a couple things that can happen there. That's, that, that one's not so common. Yeah, um, so this is called uh, credit early. Um, casually, when you're going through this game, you're going to want to try to uh, watch the shopkeeper open this safe. Two. We're going to try to just brute force this thing and open it without knowing the, uh, the, you know, the combination at all. There's four general moves that we're doing. Um, so a push and a pull and a <gasps> oh push my and a pull. Gosh. Um, so spade is... I oh, can't wow, believe we it. Hit. So we got it. This, we got credit this early. This is a pretty... Uh, Crat that uh, I think it has uh, just under a 10% chance, 11% uh, chance. Uh, we dig up the secret treasure of Melia, and all we get is this lousy t shirt. Um, but now, normally we'd go to stands, um, but since we got credit early, we just head back straight to the village here. Um, now that we've completed the three trials, we're officially a pirate. Oh, keep walking, Guybrush. So let me get uh, dressed for the job. Making it official. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Um, so now what we need to do is rescue Elaine. Elaine was kidnapped. Governor Elaine is kidnapped by the ghost pirates and the ghost pirate LeChuck. Um, so we'll need to get a crew together. We forgot Herman on Monkey Island. And that's time. 27.30. Tw Did you just say 27.30? Yeah, 27.30. That's, that's new world record. Wow. What? Wow, dude. <laughs> that's, oh my gosh, that's a huge... My 
My PB is a 2745. That's a world That's record by awesome. 15 seconds. Holy guacamole. I, I certainly did not expect that to happen today. <laughs> wow. It, I have to say, I have to tell a little bit of backstory here. So sure. the, the credit early strat, right? It's so RNG dependent to get a new PB when you're at the top level that uh, sometimes I was be streaming for two hours and not get one attempt, not get one run past credit early. And I've been yeah. grinding like for months, a couple months now, like doing resets and resets and resets. And, and, and I finally like decided to move on. And here we are, I come back, like right after I'm like moving on, I get the, I get the message, you guys bring me back on to show off the run <laughs> and here we go. Bring it back for one more. I needed to do one, one more. more time. Yeah, and we these, got it. New world record. Oh my goodness! Happened unexpectedly. Good, good job. <laughs> yeah, it was an.